Hello, and we are back with some more Final Fantasy VII Remake. Uh, where we last left off, we had completed a couple side quests here. We got one more we want to do here, this uh, Kids on Patrol. And uh, we should be able to then advance on with the rest of the story. Uh, do you want one of these? No thanks. Remember, if you uh, like you see, if you'd like to leave a like, comment, subscribe, that'd be awesome. Well, let's get going. This way. Excuse me. <laughs> or, oh, the kids are already... <sighs> we're looking for the kids with the swords, that's right. So we're looking for kids with swords. I tell you that I'm grateful for all of your help thus far. I did. I've done it. I've developed a new materia. What is it? Oh, synergy. Allows any al allows an ally to follow the leader's attack command with an attack from linked materia. Does not contain AP. All right. I look forward to receiving all of your future battle intel submissions. I said the nine things, right? Yeah. I knew there was a kid back here. The monsters out there are getting stronger and stronger. But that's no problem for you though, right? Be right. careful anyway. Bring back the show the kids with the wooden swords. There's one well, right here. What do you think? Do I have what it takes? Let's see, it doesn't count. and giving people directions. Plus, I helped an old lady cross the street. Good job. You've been busy. It's a normal day for me. Gotta work hard. The house depends on people's donations. Oh, no! I'm late! Uh, did you see Miss Folia? Is she mad? Oh, I gotta go! I'm sorry! I've been watching them really close. I'm trying to learn all about the business. You want to open up a shop of your own someday? Yeah, so I can earn lots of money and use it to help the house. The teachers don't like to talk about it, but we know the donations aren't enough to keep things running. 
But that's a secret, okay? I'm not supposed to tell anyone. Anyway, I gotta go study. Two or five. The emergency shelter is in sector one. Five. They won't target the snow. Those avalanche guys are looking for my kids. Sounds like you've made a real name for yourself, Merc. You're the mercenary? than usual. Maybe because the reactor blew up? Well, you've been keeping a very sharp lookout. But, don't you think you're forgetting something important? Oh, Miss Foley of Lessons! I gotta get back to the house! So, it's three. Four. Wow! You're that soldier, right? Can I ask you a super important question? I heard bad people broke the Mako reactor, and there's gonna be another war because of it. Is that true? Who knows? But isn't there something else you should be worrying about right now? Bitter club. I forgot about Miss Folia's lesson! I gotta head back to the house! I know. Years ago, when I came to Midgar, and when is it gonna get dark around here? You alright? Kids lost their friends and families. Who knows what might blow up next? I guess that means more children might be coming to the house soon. And I think the teachers are gonna have a whole lot more work to do. Speaking of teachers, Miss Foley is looking for you. Get oh, back. Man, I completely the house. forgot! I have to get back right now! That's everyone. Let's go back to the house. Get your hands on the hottest new scent. All right. Right up here. I'm very. The children finally came back, thanks to you two. You've been a great help. Okay, everyone, come inside. It's time to hit the books. You guys, the Toad King's back. I saw him near the hideout. We gotta do something about him. The Toad okay. King. A weird, creepy monster we've seen near the hideout lately. Look, he wears a crown that. and walks around like he owns the place. If he's not a king, he's got to be monster royalty at least. I bet a soldier could beat him up easy. Oh yeah, really? Oh, Tom Barry? But here's the thing: I don't work for free or cheap. But we don't have any money. The watch wouldn't ask for money. But if we ask any other grown-ups for help, they'll find out about the hideout, and that'll be it. We really don't want to lose the hideout. Come on, help us. Oh, and we'll give you some cool treasure if you do. And if that's not enough, I'll pay the rest of your fee once I open my shop. Well, if you won't help, then we'll just have to kill it ourselves. <sighs> I'll do it for three gil. Huh? 
I'm offering a special discount right now on Toad King jobs. Looks like it's your lucky day. Awesome. Look at you, Cloud. Now that's my kind of bargain. You can beat the Toad King no problem, right? I mean, but you're a soldier. All about the I really messed up this time. I know I can do it. Mom, can I pet him? What a softy. Toad King, where are you at? Get back. I can fight you, you know. See ya. Was never in doubt. Stuff and things down here. Get back. I can fight too, you know. Let's go. She's there. Try to stay behind me. That way I can cover your back. Enough. Not bad. I've got this. Don't you mean you've got this? Never in doubt. Right. Keep on going. Focus. <laughs> Best do it right. Leader of a Hedgehog Pie Pack, self up King wears a toy crown. Working for the uh, a certain amount of damage makes it simple to stagger and enhances the Pie itself, or its comrades are in Brawl's Tower, who is right for it. Go 
seriously, this one is bouncing on this entire thing. It's a little annoying. Ain't dead yet. Keep it together. I'm coming. Go on. Keep it up. No need to panic. Bring it. Did you defeat the Toad King? Yeah, I did. Yep. Kicked his butt real good. Awesome! I knew you could do it! Now we don't have to worry about the king and his smelly friends. Thank you so much! Here, this is for you. The treasure we promised. It's definitely worth at least three gil. Okay, kids. Playtime's over for now. I've prepared a special assignment for everyone. One that I expect you to finish today. Understood? Uh, yes! Yes, Miss Folia! I appreciate you getting rid of the Toad King, by the way. Wow, Miss Folia. You must know all their secrets. Oh, if only. Easier said than done. They're always on the move, looking for new adventures, chasing new dreams. All while trying to make the lives of everyone around them just a little bit better. I try to make sure they don't stumble and fall. And when they finally do, I help them back up. <laughs> Sounds exhausting. <laughs> Sometimes it is. But I want the children to know that until they can stand on their own two feet, that I'm here to support them, care for them, love them. That even if we're not actually related, we're still a family. A real family, in all the ways that matter. If I can do that for them, then, well, then maybe I'm making this world a better place. I know you are. My predecessor taught me everything I know. I just took up his torch and ran with it, I guess. Uh, not that I'm anything close to what he was. Biggs is one of a kind. <gasps> oh no! I've completely lost track of time! Do you have somewhere you need to be? More like a dream I need to fulfill. Thank you again for your help. What kind of dream she's chasing tonight? No idea. Thanks again for saving our hideout from the king. In return, I let everyone know you guys can join the game as special guests. The game? If you want to know more, then come to the hideout. So... The nail bat. Definitely do the same material slots because really 
probably shouldn't have. I don't think it has any. Okay. Living tar of anything and everything. Correct with attack or strong attack after switching modes. Oops, we need this. Back out of it. I do need to work on I'm just getting her proficiency up. a little weaker. For now at least. I need to do some more playing as Aerith to help that out. Check out this game. Don't kill me! I hope you will continue to help me gather vital information for my research. I look forward to receiving all of your future battle intel submissions. Man, you won't stop telling us stories about that. more movement medals that I picked up. See now that things are starting to settle down a bit, we can finally play Whack-A-Box again. whack -a -box. It's all thanks to you. Oh yeah, I forgot. There's this tired looking guy out by the community center. And I heard he was looking for some help. I heard the good news. You defeated the Toad King. That's so awesome. Good to see you, Koopa. Five. Hold on. Come back soon, Koopa. Just in case I need to use. We're gonna play whack a box. Oh, hey, Cloud. You're just in time for our favorite game, Whack a Box. You want in? It's super fun. The rules are easy. The person who whacks the most boxes is crowned champion of the hideout. We okay. usually don't let adults play, but since you're cool, we're gonna make a special exception just for you. Neat. So, Google Battles participation prize. Spectral Cogwheel, Elixir, Crescent Moon Charm. Right, so what, 30,000? Any box you can, these box size your scores. Uh, okay. Three blue boxes, wrap the fills rate to gauge, whack a box, you can use the weapon ability of your weapon and the braver ability. Showing red boxes, extend your time. Here we go. Yeah. 
ready. Sorry. Let's get this over with. Let's do this. So long. So close to the 30. Wow, Cloud! I've never seen anyone do that before! See? Pretty fun, right? Play with us again, Kay? Well, wanna play some whack a box? Yeah, we wanna get that 30. Annihilator. We'll be here whenever you want to play. I just try to get a Moogle medal over to my dude. When you want to smash stuff, he doesn't see me. Be quiet. Welcome to the Moogle Emporium. I've had this quite a few times, though. Do it eight more times. A pleasure uh, as always, Koopo. 
Not sure how I feel about that. I mean, there I can just sit there for eight more times and not do anything. Care the one guy. Uh, go up here to the left. So they tell me. Uh, you wouldn't happen to be a certain merc that's become the talk of the town? Maybe. Yep. I'm Damon, little more than a humble reporter with the daily buzz. Ugh, that rag? The one that's always printing awful rumors about the slums? On the contrary, my dear. We strive to raise awareness of the plight of our undercity brethren. We seek a better future for everyone, rich and poor. Yeah, now then, right. my friends, I find myself in need of your exceptional services for a trifling matter. Are you familiar with the mysterious and notorious bandit known as the Angel of the Slums. She delivers written declarations to her victims, usually Shinra associates, before divesting them of their valuables. Everyone knows her. Everything she steals, she gives to the poor and needy. Yes, she's Probably. got a knack for public relations. Very popular down here as a result. Nevertheless, she is a criminal and a threat to the public order. I've made it my mission to unmask the villain. The locals have been uncooperative and uncommunicative to no. mildly. And now that my identity as a reporter has been exposed, my sources have all deserted me. Which brings me to you, the merc of the hour, and the man who will serve up my scoop. Slums? Such a mysterious figure, always talked about, but never seen by anyone. The angel gets in and out without being noticed and always leaves a calling card. <gasps> Maybe a magician. No, no, it's no magic trick. It's genuine magic. Rumor has it that the angel is a witch. If we're going by rumors, then I've heard that it's actually a monster in disguise. Well, I could talk all day about the dozens of stories I've heard. Good to see you again, Murray. Good to see you too, Aerith. I'd heard you found yourself a funny new friend. Cloud, meet Murray. She knows everything there is to know about the slums. Everything. Murray, meet Cloud. He's a former soldier and super strong. Hmm, he looks useful enough. The kids have been talking about you. The defender of the secret hideout. And now the hero of the Leaf House is helping the Daily Buzz look for the Angel of the Slums. I am? <laughs> I'm a lover of the Whispered Word. Not that it's any real secret, considering how chatty the Chinra Mutt's been. Not looking into it for the reporter. I'm doing it for myself. Call it curiosity, whatever. Or oh, could it be you've fallen under the Angel's spell like so many others? Anyway, it so happens that I have some information for you. But I'll need a moment before I can give it to you. Why don't you wait with that reporter of yours? There's some youngster going around lending a hand to those in hand. You can see the sky? Of course. It was there for the looking. I've heard about you. <laughs> so, any news? Have you tried talking to Murray at all? She told us that she had some information to share. Murray, as in the Murray, the town gossip. I chased her for days, begging for info, like but she wouldn't give up you? a single scrap. So how do you get the old bird to talk? This old bird had a change of heart. That's all. Then quickly, before you have another, tell us what do you know about the notorious angel of the slums? Has she struck again? Is that it? I don't know anything about that, but I do know where her hideout is. Base of operations? Now that's a scoop! Where is it? Tell me! 
deep in the scrap at Lookout Point. Hardly anyone goes out there these days. It's the perfect place for a criminal to hold up. Lookout Point. Got it. I'll check it out right now. But before you go, I should warn you about this rumor I heard about a terrible fiend that's claimed the Angel's hideout as its lair. Oh, quite large. Lots of teeth. Always hungry. I don't know about you, but I'd not go anywhere near that thing. I guess she's the angel well, of the slums. Uh, <clears throat> well, a good reporter knows never to take foolish risks. Uh, plan first, then act. That's every respectable journalist motto. If it's a plan you're looking for, I'd say you have one right here. Wouldn't you? So, my good mercenary, if I might impose upon you again, it would be lovely if you investigated Lookout Point for me. Where's Lookout Point? Oh, crap, all the way over here. Let's go. Come on, but I want to climb. Will he bite me? That's what's called easy money. Let's do a quick save. Been a long chapter so far. And yes, part of it is. I hope you will continue to help me gather vital information for my research. I look forward to receiving all of your future battle intel submissions. Part of it's because I'm doing all these side quests. But... Yeah, or why we should go right. Back. I can fight too, you know. I'll show you what I can do. <laughs> One more shot. Mind backing off a bit. <laughs> Just a bit. <laughs> Efficiencies. Was never in doubt. Okay. Just like it. Hello. Going in. But we're in a rush. I got your number. Normally, I text not a the standard gauge, but it's a certain number of amount of physical damage does so Staggering through a hideous wrecking ball from magic attacks will quickly build staggered gauge. Get him! So it's my turn? Is that it? <laughs> 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 Back to good now. This one's for you. You 
too jittery? I'm waiting. Uh, one more. Uh. Silence goes for the head. Uh. Get him. Bring it. Yeah. Go on. I think we're almost done. How shocking. That's it. Too bright? Go on. Here it comes. <laughs> you can do it. Hang back. Here goes. My turn. Um, That'll do. This one's for you. I'll take care of them. You jittery? Come on. <laughs> This quest. Take a look around the area and search for clues to the angel's whereabouts. There we go. Calling cards obtained. The guardian angel of the slums will collect your offering on behalf of the poor. This must be one of her calling cards. I don't see anything else interesting. Let's head back and tell him what we found. Yes. I can't believe it! You found one of her calling cards! This is the genuine article, I'm sure of it, pinned by the angel herself! Hmm. So this is one of her famous warnings. It's an incredible find! Oh, was that all? Hold on. Looks like there's something else. A message. To the nosy Shinra reporter sniffing around, I was planning to teach you a lesson you would never forget. 
However, by the grace of your mercenary friend, you were spared that lesson. But next time, he might not be around to save you. You would be wise to watch your step. Not just a message from the angel, a warning. If the Merc here hadn't bailed you out, that fiend in the scrap would have ripped you to shreds. Sorry about that, friend. Here I was, just trying to help you out. But instead, my kindness almost got you violently killed. Now, now. No harm, no foul, right? In any case, I hope this narrowly averted tragedy won't discourage you from sharing information with me in the future. Hey, everybody! The angel left another calling card! She's gonna rip up Don Corneo! It's about damn time! Don Corneo's no easy mark! I can't wait to see how this goes down! Excuse me, I'm a reporter for the Daily Buzz and... So much for my reward. Here, why don't you take this? Oh, and no need to thank me. Gil. Let's just say it slipped out of that reporter's pocket. <laughs> can't call it theft if you're just claiming what you're owed. Am I right? Well done, Mr. Merck. You certainly lived up to your reputation. She definitely has to be the angel of the slums. We probably ought to call it a day. Getting late, huh? You've been working so hard you lost track of time. Had to. The pace sucked. Because they didn't know if you were worth it yet. But now they do. Come on, let's go home. Let's save first. I thought we'd put those days of war and death behind us, sure. but uh, Mutai yeah. won't let us move on. Uh, what's up, Rude? Hello, Aerith. What do you want? Haven't seen him before. He your new boy toy? He's my bodyguard, if you must know. Wait a minute. Those eyes. Is he the one who beat up Reno? And what if I am? Need to cross my T's, dot my I's, that's all. Cloud, leave him be. Rude's not a bad person, really. No, I'm not bad. But like it or not, I sometimes have to do bad things. <sighs> Don't take it personal. You right, Turks are all the same. All bark, no bite. You're one to talk. No need to get rough. Stay back. Get ready. <laughs> <laughs> Go on. 
needed on standby for a job and something about Sector 7. So get your ass back here now. Understood. Got somewhere else to be? Apparently so. Go home and stay there. You know I can't do that. Huh? Oh, Mally. Anything special hidden in here? Doesn't look like it.
again. Let's do a little save. Wait a sec. So, you coming? Where are you going? Talking to the Shh. So yeah, it was that kind of day. <sighs> Let's go. Shouldn't keep mom waiting. Hey. What'd they say? Good work today, guys. Kidding. They didn't say a word. But, you know... Uh, never mind. It's not like you'd believe me, after all. Hmm. Probably not. <sighs> Tell me anyway. Really? Yeah. It won't be much longer now. The flowers, they... They have something important to tell us. Something they... Need to share with us. At least, that's the feeling I get. But, before they can... There's a final step that has to be taken. Otherwise, we won't hear them. Maybe I should just give up. Honestly, it's what I do best. Could have fooled me. From what I've seen, you're no quitter. Well, today's special. That's why I've been working my butt off. Uh, what's so special about it? <laughs> okay, time to go. Learn to talk to her. Did the flower say anything? Uh, good work today, guys? <laughs> That's the spirit. Let's go back to the house. You're heading in already? Nah, not quite yet. So... Are we able... I don't know. I don't know if we can venture out further back to the church to find that material or not. Uh, we'll decide what we're going to do next time. So, uh, thanks for watching. If you like what you saw, if you'd like to leave a like, comment, subscribe, that'd be awesome. Because here we're going to probably be moving from, uh, to the next, uh, chapter. So, uh, until then, we'll see you next time.